The, the biggest thing that we have right now in early season practice, we have 15 people out there that's healthy. I mean, for us. Uh, I mean, last year was a tough year. We had so many injuries and uh, early injuries, too. Not, not just late injuries, but we had injuries from the beginning. And now we have 15 people out that's working in the competition for playing time. From that standpoint, it's been really good. And you can tell, you know, we're at that point where we're trying to semi-separate five over here and five over there and the competition to make that five over here and be in that top eight, nine, ten, it's really, it's been good for us. So we've had, uh, out of the number of practices we've had, I think we've had 12 or 13, something like that. I, I would count that maybe one of them was not probably that good. And so the consistency in practice has been really good. Well, I think the big thing is what you said is exactly right, the chemistry. The chemistry part of it has been really the biggest thing for us. We, we, have, a lot, we have a lot of new players from the standpoint that will be eligible to play. We had five kids registered last year that would be eligible to play. We brought in three freshmen. So out of that 15, that's eight out of the 15 that we have that was, didn't play last year. And so blending them in with the people that played a lot, we got a lot of people back that played a lot of minutes that's not going to play that many minutes this year. but because they want to be successful. I think what they all realize now, I just need to play hard when I have that opportunity to play. And so this first 15 days for us, has been, it's been great because of the chemistry and because everybody's realizing we have more players. So before, when I thought I had to play 30 minutes, I couldn't go full speed the whole time. Well, now I know I'm going to have to play 20 minutes and I can go full speed during that period of time. Well, what we did this year from a non-conference schedule, we, we beefed it up. And we, knew, we knew we were going to have, we felt like we were going to have a pretty good b group of young ladies coming back and with the people we had sitting out, well, we knew the group we had sitting out was not going to be bad. And so we, we beefed up our schedule to get ready to go into the SEC. We're going on the road and we're going to Houston. We're playing in Virginia. We're going, you know, we had tried to schedule Duke this past year. Couldn't work it out. I think we had them the next year. And so we're really beefing up our schedule and, and going into places instead of having those home games to, uh, that you pay people to come and play. We're actually going into places like we're going to Troy this year. And they're going to come to us for the two-for-one deal. Instead of we want to go, and, and, and regardless of what where we're going, we need to learn how to play on the road, and we need to learn how to play basketball, adjusting to different places, different officiating, different everything. And so uh, we have really beefed up our schedule, and we're getting ready to go into the SEC and want to be as successful as we can there. Well, I think the big thing that we're going to play three games back to back and, and just an opportunity to, to, to get back and play games before we get back into the SEC, you know. And, you know, we could come back and practice and play one game, but we're going to have three games being played. Uh, so we're real excited. And the competition that we're going to play over in Hawaii, we're real excited about that. So we think all of that would help us get ready to go into the SEC and play. Well, uh, the, the, the thing that I think about the SEC right now is when Texas A&M and Missouri came in, I thought we were already the toughest league in the country, but Texas A&M and Missouri had really kicked it up. But the good thing about the league, because of changing in coaches and, you know, Pat is not here, uh, it's going to be a really, I think, fun time to figure out where everybody fit in and the competition to win a game and to move up in the league is going to be fierce this year.